Sam Alvey is officially the karate combat goat. He's the heavyweight goat. He's the inaugural <laughs> karate combat heavyweight champion. I can't believe I'm saying this. He just beat the shit out of Ross Levine, uh, former glory kickboxer. He did use his grappling to win, but still, he beat the fuck out of him. Uh, he dropped him in one of the rounds. So you can't even say that his, it was because of the grappling there. And he, whenever he got the ground and pound positions, he just fucked him up. Uh, Sam Alvey's the GOAT. I thought he was going to get fucking annihilated, I'm not going to lie. I really thought this was going to be a really bad beating for uh, Sam Alvey, but I'm fucking, I'm wrong. Sam Alvey's the GOAT. Uh, look at that pretty belt around Sam Alvey's waist. Uh, yeah, I, I, I can't believe it. I really can't believe this. Uh, yeah, so Sam Alvey is the fucking, <laughs> the champ, he, like, Ross Levine has not really lost many fights, I think he was undefeated in glory, like, I think his only loss was, like, an amateur Muay Thai fight back in the day, at least according to Tapology, yeah, he was one, two, three, four, it was four and oh, at least according to Tapology, but fucking Sam Alvey, like, fucking comes in and absolutely smokes him, beats the fuck out of him, uh, drops him, ground and pounds him, Ross Levine is younger, it's not even you can say he's washed, he is younger than fucking Sam Alvey, like, what the fuck happened here, I, I don't understand it, respect to Sam Alvey, man, uh, what a, what a career turnaround, Mike Perry has BKFC, uh, and Sam Alvey's got karate combat, obviously, so this is his little niche sport that he's got for himself, and respect, he's found what he's good at, karate, I didn't think fucking Sam Alvey would be fucking here whooping ass in karate combat, but here we are, what a fucking world we live in, man, what a world we live in, but respect to the GOAT, Sam Alvey, you know, he went in there, proved me wrong, I thought he was going to get massacred, so Sam Alvey, fucking hats off to you, bro, like, hats off, like, generally, this is a shocking result, this is, nobody was predicting Sam Alvey to go in there and win, if you fucking predicted Sam Alvey, you're a fucking liar, uh, respect, I don't know what's next for Sam Alvey in his conquest, I don't even know who he can fight, uh, maybe he can do a Raymond Daniels matchup somehow, uh, in a lower weight class or something, but yeah, Sam Alvey, somehow fucking chads his way to victory, this was like the karate combat version of Israel Adesanya, versus Sean Strickland, Alvey just pressuring forward like a fucking Chad, taking all the leg kicks and just fucking pressuring and landing big shots, respect though, Sam Alvey proves me wrong, he is the GOAT, official karate combat GOAT, he actually is the GOAT now, uh, there's not much competition, it's a new organization, he's the first heavyweight champ, so I don't care, I'm calling him the heavyweight GOAT, uh, on a real though, this makes Karate Combat look really shit that a UFC reject on a seven fight losing streak in the UFC just comes in there and fucking wins your championship in his second fight. But still, respect to Sam Alvey, respect the GOAT. Uh, yeah, he gets it done. Anyway, that's all I've got to say. Benson Henderson versus Anthony Pettis 3 is about to go down, so I'm just going to watch that, and I'll give my reaction to that when that one finishes, so yeah, thanks for watching, make sure you give this video a like, let me know your thoughts on the fight if you watched it, subscribe if you ain't already, I watch all sorts of combat sports, I'm a fucking, I'm a fucking addict, I'm an addict, I'm a combat sports addict, I can't just not watch these fights, it doesn't matter the rule set, but yeah, anyway, yeah, make sure you subscribe, I'll see you guys next time, thanks for watching, cheers.